quick tech tip on grading. How to grade student work in Google Classroom. Of course, the first thing you need to do is head where? Google Classroom. Okay, so we're gonna head to the Google Classroom. We're in my Google Classroom, and you're gonna go to the assignment that you need to grade. So I assigned my students a quiz on the stories Julian tells. Um, to grade the assignment, I have one student who's turned it in, and here you would go, you can manually grade an assignment or depending on the assignment that you are working on, if it's a um, Google form and you've um, did automatic grading on that, then you will be able to import the grades from Google forms. So if I wanted to manually grade Chloe's assignment, I would of course click and I would look at her assignment. I would determine what grade she has and then manually here, I would just enter her grade in manually. And then Chloe has a 30 out of 30. If I wanted to grade her assignment by importing it from Google Forms, How doing? All right. So now we fix it. No grade now. So if we wanted to grade it based on importing it from a Google Form, we would just go here, and her assignment is turned in, and we would just import her grades from Google Form. Am I sure? Yes. Let's import it. And it always asks you, are you sure? Because whatever you import will override what you manually input it. So even if I left the 30 that I manually input it, or if I input 25, but then I imported it from Google Class from Google Forms and it says 30, then it's gonna override whatever you had. So now her grades are imported and she has a 30 out of 30. So that is how you grade a student's assignment in Google Classroom.